Hi everybody, I am Lorenzo from lorenzgraphicart.com and today I wanna show you how to make a gold material in a Cinema 4D. Let's create a new cube. Then set the cube size, for example, 70 by 300 by 70. Then set segments 10 by 10 by 10. Okay, then let's go to the deformer tab and let's create uh, the twist deformer. Select twist and drag and drop into the cube. Then set twist and let's go to the twist menu. Set angle by 360 degrees. Change the mode by unlimited. Then let's create a new penurbs. Make the cube a child of the hypernurbs object. Ok, now select hypernodes and make added one. Then let's go to the deformer tab again and select band. Set band and drag and drop into the hypernodes. Set strength by 309. And check on keep y axis length then let's create a new shear and make the shear a child of the hypernurbs object okay now select shear and change the position by 90 degrees strength by by 100% for example and angle by 250 degrees Okay, now let's create a new spline and set linear spline. Right click, set create point. Then select the spline and set type by B spline ok now copy this spline and Let's create a new pair norms. Select these splines and drag and drop into the hyper norms. Let's create a new plane. And let's create a new plane again for the lights.
then let's create a new plane again and set width 200 and height 200 and let's create a new cloner select this plane and drag it drop into the cloner set cloner and let's go to the cloner menu and set mode by grid array and set count by 3 by 1 by 2 Let's create a new material, set color, set R240 by 207 and 88 for example, then let's go to the texture, set layer, go to the shader and select noise. set noise and set turbulence then set global scale by 0.2% set color 1 by light gray for example okay then let's go to the shader again and select Fresnel set gradient and set light gray and white for example set Fresnel and set multiply and set mix mode multiply okay then check on reflection and set R 255, 250 and 212 and let's go to the texture again and select Fresnel change color and check physical set 6 Mix mode by multiply again and check additive set blurriness by 10% then check on bump let's go to the texture and select layer go to the shader and select noise again then set noise turbulence global scale 750% and set color 1 by light gray and white then shader let's go to the shader again and let's create a fresnel select color by light gray and white for example and set Fresnel multiply okay then let's go to the specular and set color by 
255, 212, 250, and 212. Set mode, uh, set width by 70%, and height by 150%, and set mode by metal. For example, strength by 5% Okay, now let's create a new material again. And set white color for the background. And then let's create a new material. Check up color and check on luminance. Let's go to the texture, select gradient set type by 2d circular Okay, now let's go to the render settings, go to the Optut menu, select Film Video and HDTV. Format, for example, JPG or uh, PNG, for example. Then let's go to the Effect menu, set Global Illumination, set Low Settings. Go to the effect again and set ambient occlusions. And then let's go to the anti analyzing and set best. Okay, now let's create a new light. Then copy the Hypernorbs object, 